got done with her color, um, so I'm excited to show you that when we dry it. Uh, now we are going to do her cut, so I'm going to have her put her head um, down. We're just going to come straight across here in the back. This, this is a lot shorter than she's had um, in a while, but we just got uh, those ends off and it's going to be super duper healthy and look really, really good. I'm excited about it. Okay, now when you get to the side, you just push their, their head to the side a tiny bit. Okay, and then up and over. You doing good, sweetie? Mm -hmm. Okay. Am I doing the right thing? <laughs> yes, you're doing good. <laughs> okay, now I'm just coming here on the side, pulling it straight down. And it's going to be nice. She's had some um, longer bangs in the front, like off to the side. So we're just going to take those and connect the sides, just blend it in good. Okay, again, I'm going to have her head down. Just think, all that, you don't have to blow dry. <laughs> okay, and then the side, tilt their head, make sure the chin's up. If the chin is not up, it will be shorter when you go to lift their head up. So make sure their chin, is, it doesn't need to be up, it just needs to be straight. Okay, and then of course you're going to, Hold down both sides, make sure they're even. Okay, now I'm going to add some long layers into her hair. So I'm going to take the first part up here. Okay, just going to point cut into that. See, that barely is taking any off of that area. See, it just takes those ends, so it's not taking a ton. Um, that'll just help when we dry it. It'll look really, really nice. Um, give it some movement a little bit, just so it's not all one length at the bottom. Start on this side. Yeah, when you get to the back, there's hardly any, just a tiny little corner there. Okay, now I'm going to turn it this way so I can do this side. Just pull all this up. She's, oh, is it? Yeah, that's all right. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that. Oh, that's fine. No worries. No worries. Our phones have gone off before. It's, it's all good. Okay. All right. There we go. Okay. Now for the front. I'm just going to hold this up. there. Same thing with this side. I like to point cut into it. Okay, now she just wears her part down the middle.
All right, so this yeah. side, this side, yep, yeah, perfect. You're perfect. Is a little bit shorter with your bangs there. Mm -hmm. um, in fact, I want to make sure. There we go. Had to make sure her part was right. <laughs> anyway, so I'll, you, you just want me to even that out, right? Yeah. With your sign? Okay. So we're just going to come right here. We're just going to blend this in with just opening your shears and closing them in short little like, like that, okay? As I make the noise. <laughs> anyway. Oh my goodness. Okay, same thing. And then when you're done, uh, like blow drying and stuff, if you need to go in and cut something a little different or a little shorter, you can. That's what's nice about after you dry it, you can see how it's going to lay. Okay, perfect. All right, now we will give Christy a little bit of texture. Um, because her hair is long, it's obviously weighed down, right? So this will just give her a little bit of movement, um, <clears throat> and it'll give just a few little uh, short hairs underneath there so the long hairs can sit on top of it. So uh, it gives it a little volume. Okay. Just combing that hair out. Now, all right, I am going to do a little bit of the root lifter here, up through the top when I dry. We're getting all sorts of calls over there. I know, I'm like, what's going on? <laughs> yeah. Okay, um, where is my, all right. Uh, this blowout cream protects the ends for when you curl, blow dry, um, flat iron, all of that. So I'm going to put that throughout. And that smells phenomenal. Oh, it does. It smells really good. Cheery. It does smell really good. Awesome. Okay, so now I'm just going to blow dry this way. Give some height on the top if you, you know, have longer hair like this. Take this up. So uh, it's not obviously all the way dry, but it's quite a 
it. And what you want to do is make sure your hair isn't sopping wet when you uh, round brush. That will pull on your hair. It's not healthy for your hair. together and I put all on her hair. Okay, this helps the curl um, hold. Okay, now I wanted to talk to you guys too about that. The reason I am curling her hair is um, older women um, with longer hair, it's really, with gray in it, is really, really good to curl the hair. You don't notice gray as much um, if it's curled. So I'm just using the wand. I'm just gonna curl this as I go when I dry. Anyway, this is gonna be so pretty, I can't wait. <laughs> So yes, you can use the wand, you can use your uh, flat iron. And what's nice um, with this also is, you know, it'll last a couple days, so that's always nice. Um, the other thing, so with gray hair, um, to blend like we are blending, it's really, really good to go as long as you can uh, with out washing so you know a couple days if you can that's really good obviously on your color too you know so if you can don't wash it every day uh, that's what's hard too like the the older our hair gets um you know it loses shine and luster and all that and i'm super excited the shampoo we used uh, definitely, yeah, shine. And then I have a shine spray I'm going to use. Um, and so we'll make it look really, really good. Wow, Christy, super duper duper healthy. <laughs> yeah, it is. Yes, it is. Okay. Same thing. I'm gonna spray three squirts, rub it here, and then I just put it on all of the hair that is not curled, obviously. And then I'm going to take it this way, just wrap it around. Usually I wear my glove, but where I'm gonna like blow dry and stuff in between, I'm not. Um, you never know, I might burn myself a couple times. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> in fact, that's what that scar's from. Gotta love that. Yeah, this is kind of nice. Um, like I say, I like to kind of curl it as I go. Um, and then in the end, you're just, you're done. So. Are you getting excited or nervous? A little bit I'm of both. Excited. <laughs> nervous, a little bit of wondering. That's right. <laughs> Well, you usually don't curl your hair, right? No, no, I, I'm really um, not a curler. Right. <laughs> I'm uh, hair enabled. So. Hair enabled. <laughs> <laughs> well, today she gets curls. <laughs>
light, I will try. I love using a big round brush, brush like this on longer hair, obviously. And if you have time, you can sit and hold it like that and let it cool and then let, let it go. I don't want to say it, but I'm doing pretty good. I haven't burned myself yet. <laughs> I know a ton of people don't use gloves either, but. so you guys can see this. I apologize. Woo. See, that's why I like my glove on, because then I just grab my glove and I go over all of it and just hold on to it, all the hair onto it, so I don't lose it. So when it grows out, it will be awesome. Okay, same thing. This, you come back on the wand, on the sides. Just wrap it around. See, that's how I lose it. <laughs> This morning, and she got her snow, and she's like, Oh, mom, that really does sting. I'm like, mm -hmm. <laughs> Darn it, definitely no.
here. <laughs> You do have a lot of hair. <laughs> you do have a ton of hair. Oh, That's too. awesome. Good for you. When I was younger, it was like probably three times thicker. Really? Oh, yeah. oh, my head is so thick. So see, that's good you have that much to go through. Yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. Get to wear it out. Eventually over time. <laughs> right. That's awesome. Good for you. And then I'll obviously like comb those out so they're not tight. 